Hi, I am so excited to be with you today and I am at a private club and I am so excited to show you behind the scenes of what private clubs and golf clubs and country clubs are really all about. I always had it in my mind they're a little bit snooty tooty stuffy. Now I had it wrong. They're actually a lot of fun. There's all sorts of great social events. I've made great girlfriends. I picked up golf, actually I'm learning golf I should say, I'm going to have a golf lesson later. I love the shopping, the food, I also love that they have babysitting for my son which is really, really kind of fun because my husband and I can actually have a peaceful dinner and my son can go and have fun with his friends. It's really a one stop shop for everyone in the family. I'm looking forward to sharing this experience with you. Come along and join me. I'll see you in the pro shop. Shopping! I'm in the pro shop of Fieldstone Golf Club and what's nice is, no, there's a lot more here than just balls and tees and golf clubs. There's all sorts of wonderful things. One of my favorites is this glass. This is from Bar and Vine. Now I have a lot of this product in my house. My friends unfortunately have broken a lot of my wine glasses. Customer service at Bar and Vine knows me personally very well. These are great products. They're etched. You can order them off the website barandvine.com and you can put your name, your corporate logo, you can put your monogram. It's unbelievable and it ships in 8 to 10 days which is one of the great things about it. The customer service with this company is outstanding. Uh, but Wait, Kelsey McLean, that's me. My day job, I actually designed baby and children's clothing made out of 100% Pima cotton and they're stylish, they're classic. The Fieldstone logo's on this one. You can get them with your name, your monogram, whatever you want at KelseyMcLean.com and best of all, it ships in two business days. So these are just a few samplings of some of the really cool things that golf shops, pro shops have to offer and now, for most importantly, I've got to get my outfit on because I'm gonna go take my first golf lesson. Yay! I am so excited. I'm ready to take my first golf lesson. I've got my little golf outfit on and it's from Nevo Sport. It's super comfortable. It's got these little pockets. I'm gonna get rid of all the yoga pants because this is so much better. Anyway, with no further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and take my first golf lesson and you're going to be amused. Oh, and you know what? Apparently I have to wear golf shoes. High heels are not allowed on the golf course, are they? Yeah. Great. Well, thanks for coming out for uh, your first lesson today, Kelsey. Well, thank you for having the patience sure. to have me because I'm not sure if I do. And um, I actually am not paid to be here. <laughs> <laughs> what I like to do with, um, with new players to the game, we want you to obviously enjoy the game. So let's not start out on something that's too, too difficult. We'll have you hit a couple of chip shots here from near the green. So I'm supposed to get the... the yeah, the fewer the strokes, the better, right? Fewer okay. strokes, the better. We've given okay, you an so. eight iron, so good club selections. Okay, always here important. we go. Oops. Oops. Nice small swing. Shorter swing. Shorter swing. Okay, let's try this again. Shorter swing. See, most of the time people get next to the green and they choose In a wedge the hole. or something. I mean, that was phenomenal. So now do I get the putter? Yeah, let's do, do some putting here. Do, I mean, do I go to the ball? Because I want to get that ball in the hole. Yeah. We want, the, we want, want to send that, it home. I want to send that ball where it belongs. That's right. In the hole. We're going to send it home here. Little, nice little medium swing here. There you go. Go, go, good. go, good, go, good, go, good, good, good. Go. <laughs> here we go. Awesome! Yeah! <laughs> Woohoo! Great! I love Sorry. it. Sorry. I think it's supposed to be goal. Where's that hole in one? That was uh, Oh, is that a birdie one or is that three, an eagle? Times four, yeah. <laughs> that was good. This was has been really fun. A lot of and fun. We you hope know to see you out here more. You're going to. And good. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get better. I don't wanna make any promises, but I'll get better. Awesome. So we'll see and I'm looking forward to bringing my girlfriends out here too because I think this More would be a yep. really fun thing to share. Some of my girlfriends are avid golfers. Some of them are like, mm -hmm. and some of them are like, eh. But uh, you know what? It actually is fun. And I can imagine coming out with a group of girls. This yeah. would be a blast. Come out, play three holes, go have a glass of wine, enjoy the rest of the evening. I mean, you don't have to you know, do the standard nine holes, 18 holes. Start off just with you know, finding your own comfort level. Hey, Chef Barbers, how hey, Kelsey, are you? How Good are you? to see you. Good to see you as I have well. worked up an incredible appetite on the golf course. Excellent. I'm famished and I'm thirsty too, but you know what? I want to see 
Show me the love. Show me what you can do. All right, we'll show you one of our seasonal dishes that we tend to do around this time of year. Uh, it's called shrimp santorini. So it's a very simple dish. We start with some extra virgin olive oil. Uh, we heat that up on a medium heat in a, in a saute pan. We add some fresh uh, jumbo shrimp. We add some grape tomatoes with a little bit of garlic, some spinach, a little bit of salt, uh, some fresh herbs, and a little, the little hint of Aleppo pepper, which is kind of like a red pepper flake, but just a little bit more refined in flavor. Uh, so we, we saute that. Uh, just let the wine cook down a little bit just to kind of intensify the flavor. Uh, we then put it into a boat we add some feta cheese, finish with a little bit more extra virgin olive oil, and then garnish with some uh, crusty baguette. Love it. Thank you. I can't wait to eat it. Great. One of our featured desserts is our triple chocolate uh, blondie sundae. So it's a, a blondie, like a chocolate chip cookie version of a brownie uh, with white chocolate, dark chocolate, milk chocolate, uh, candied pecans, uh, caramel sauce, chocolate really? sauce, and ice cream. Hey, Kelsey. Hey, Megan. How are you? How are you? Good so to see you. you. I need a cocktail. I'm so glad you're here, actually. I was just working on one of our new signature cocktails for the summer menu. It's an acai margarita. Will you What's try that? it? What? It's, so, a, what? it's um, Sadia is the acai liqueur. It's Ooh. all natural, made from actual acai berries. So am I going to get younger drinking this? You are. You I can are. drink myself to you? Absolutely. Oh, and wonderful. it is all fresh ingredients, fresh agave, fresh lime, wow. so low calorie. Yeah. Wow. Will you so try it? Yeah, make are right. you kidding me? So super simple, in case you ever want to make it at home. Can I, so can, I can stop working out and drinking? Yes, ma'am. Oh, yes, great. Ma that's why, so we, I that's stop why working we're out. putting it on the menu. I love it. <laughs> so just four lime wedges and about, about an ounce of agave nectar. Okay. You could use simple syrup if you want. It's not quite as healthy, so we like to use the agave. So this is our muddler. Okay. So we just muddle the lime. Okay. Then we use Patron Silver. You could use any tequila of your choice, but we we like Patron here. So it's going to be about a two ounce. You can pour more. Um, oh, come three on. Ounce. Sherry is curious. Come on. <laughs> Then we do about a half ounce yep. of the sadia. That's the acai liqueur. So just about a half ounce of that. Give it a quick shake. We'll salt our glass. Strain over our fresh ice. Oh my goodness, that beautiful, huh? Okay, it looks beautiful. Let me have a taste. And do you mind? Oh, with a lime. Oh, I, I can't wait. Can I squeeze it for you? Yeah, please. Do you have any umbrellas? Mm. <laughs> I might. No, 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 it's okay. <laughs> Enjoy. Cheers. Okay, that is fantastic. Is it good? Oh my gosh. You love it? Yeah, Yay. I love it. Awesome. Cheers. I, know, I was really happy this, with it. Cheers. This is really, really good. Yeah, good. Thank I'm you. I'm so glad. You're welcome. Enjoy. So, Jerome, one of the great things I've noticed that you've done with the club that is so impressive is you have added all these great things, movie nights, family nights. Tell me about them and where did you get the idea well, for them? Part of it is all my experience in the clubs. Uh, it's more of a lifestyle, not just golf, and we're trying to expand that. So we're trying to get members to come out here more often, coming out for dining events. We have Maine Lobster, Alaskan King Crab, New England Clam Bake, Taco Fiesta Nights. So we're making, try, trying to turn every little event into some type of celebration to get the members out here, get them excited, get them to utilize the club, get them to bring their families out here. And their friends. I mean, you had, you had a great ladies night the other night Definitely. and my girlfriends all enjoyed it. We had a great time. By the way, if I didn't introduce this gentleman, this is Jerome. He is the general manager here at Fieldstone and he has done a fantastic job of making Fieldstone friendly and fun, whether you bring your children, whether you have your child babysat, have a couple's night, a romantic dinner, whether you have movie night, I, I could go on and on and on, but it's a fun, easy place. And I mean, you, you've really mastered it and I've got to hand you the keys to it because we come here a lot more. Well, and that's that's the whole goal. I mean, it used to be the saying the best customer was the member who never showed up and just paid their dues. It doesn't work that way. We want our members to be here every day. We're part of the family. We are a golf club, so we have the uh, golf pro actually, they're doing a continental with clinics. So we do free clinics for ladies trying to get the ladies more involved. We're trying to grow the game. You know what? I had a really good time and I know you're not a golfer and I'm not a golfer, so I'm gonna I'm gonna really work on becoming one. I'm not making any promises though. It's probably gonna be one of my goals over the next year. You know what? Maybe we can learn together. Yep. So thank you again and what a wonderful job. My pleasure. Thank you so much for joining me today at Fieldstone Golf Club. I hope you've had as much fun as I have. Please be sure and subscribe to our YouTube channel, like it. We also want to hear comments from you. Do you have a venue you would suggest? A private club, a golf club, a country club? We like to go behind the scenes and show the great things these places have to offer. Until next time, I'm Kelsey McLean, and thank you for joining me.